Hi, I'm Jesper. I'm part of the ST TouchDFX team. And in this video, I will show you the new features in the TouchDFX designer, uh, the features that was added in 4.15 and 4.16. The Add Widget menu has been moved from the location underneath the screen to the left to its own um, menu here that can pop out like this. Uh, it has all the widgets down here and it has a a search bar here with fuzzy search so if I write box it will give me box and everything that contains box if I say like BP it will give me box progress because it has those uh, <coughs> those uh, characters in that order I can press enter and it will add it uh, I can reopen the menu again by pressing add Backspace will clear the, the field and I can do my search again. I can also just add new uh, elements um, and it will stay open until I close it or I press, press enter. Um, if I compile by pressing run simulator, I can see there's now an animation here showing that I'm compiling and it will be green or red uh, depending on the success of the compilation. Um, I can press the bar here and it will open up a, um, a description field on, on the progress of my compilation. I can um, pop out, uh, pop it out and have it as a separate window. I can dug it again and I can, I can close it. The information that is printed out while compiling has also been cleaned up, so it should be easier to see what actually goes on. In the help menu, you'll see some new uh, points here. So there's a link to the documentation. So in the documentation, you'll find all you need on how to do uh, TouchDFX applications. Um, there's a link to the Q&A. So uh, the community site concerning TouchDFX on ST.com. Here you can find a lot of discussions on, on interesting things and you can post your own um, questions as well. Uh, we also have a page for uh, requesting features. So again on the community site in ST.com, you can go to the idea zone Go down here in the categories and select touch the effects. Here you'll see a lot of ideas and uh, discussion on features and you can uh, vote for them if you really would like this feature uh, as well. And finally in the help menu you also have a, a link to the keyboard shortcuts in touch the effects. So again this is in the documentation. You will see the uh, designer features um, and the shortcuts for those. And uh, the same goes for the simulator features. So here you have a lot of nice features as well. A final small feature that I would like to, to mention is uh, this center cameras uh, shortcut. So if you have been playing around and doing various things uh, with your canvas and you would like to center it, you can press here and it will be in center again. Yeah, that was all from me. Hope you enjoyed this video on uh, improvements to the uh, TouchDFX Designer in 4.15 and 4.16.